ट्वेंटी एंड दिस इज योर पेज नंबर वन एंड टूडे टॉपिक इज ऑक्सिलरीज टू ट्रेड इन माई लास्ट क्लास आई हैव टोल्ड टू यू अबाउट द कॉमर्स एंड देर आर द टू पार्ट ऑफ द कॉमर्स फर्स्ट इज रिलेट फ्रॉम द ट्रेड एंड सेकेंड इज रिलेट फ्रॉम द ऑक्सिलरीज टू ट्रेड यू कैन ऑल्सो सी हियर this part has been also explained by me in my previous class in the, the in that class i have explained about the trade in a proper way as like that will be relates from the internal or external it means domestic or foreign trade then after that types of the trade okay so now today's topic is relates from the auxiliaries to trade this is your topic for today okay before uh, my previous classes i have also explained you about the industries okay and also explain uh, how many types of the industries as like primary industry secondary industry and tertiary industries in my last class i have also discussed about the tertiary industries in the tertiary industries i have told to you as like this you can also see it in my previous class that was uh, i have taken on 14th april 2020 in page number 1 i have explained about the tertiary industries in the tertiary industries i have told to you tertiary activities assist trade on auxiliaries to trade thus can be a part of commerce as well it means that is related from the <coughs> auxiliaries to trade so here i want to explain it in a short way okay because that is totally that type of the activity is also based on the tertiary uh, tertiary industries okay students so listen carefully auxiliaries to trade auxiliaries to trade involves services which assist all activities related to trade and industry trade and industry okay it means all in the auxiliary trade all the activities you will be involved that will be related from the trade and industry important auxiliaries are are point number 1 transportation point number 2 communication third point banking and finance fourth point insurance fifth point warehousing and last sixth point advertising in the auxiliary aux, auxiliaries to trade i have told to you all the activities related from the tertiary industries it means that about the activities that will be related from the tertiary industries that activity involves in the auxiliaries to trade also so here it has been given activity related to trade and industry and that type of the activity will provide the support to perform the activities of the business as like without transportation uh, the businessman can cannot perform well communication is also necessary for each and every type of the business without banking and finance transactions no one can involve the business in, uh, activities in a proper way insurance also also mandatory for the business and i have also explained uh, warehousing about the warehousing in my last class in uh, warehousing i have told to you it will be relates on the go down work it means all the goods that has been produced by the businessman it is not necessary that all the goods has been sold out by the businessman in a time at the time of the productions so at that time the goods has been stored by the businessman in their go down or any other places so that type of the activity is relates from the warehousing these activities has been also explained in my previous class in tertiary industries now next is advertising advertising is also necessary without advertising no one can 
run business with fame so for the purpose of the ad, uh, advertisement is related from to famous the their business their activities of the business in the society or in the country or that will be related from the outside the country so these types of the activities is based on the auxiliaries to trade because without following without uh, accepting that type of the activities no one business can achieve their target of the business clear students any doubt then you can ask the query all these types of the activities i have also explained in the primary in the tertiary industries okay so students here i have explained it in short because that is same as like your tertiary tertiary industries okay so if you have any doubt so you can send the message okay ask any query so now i want to come on my next topic that is related from the business risk business risk so listen what is business risk you know do a businessman or do a business is established with an aim to earn profit but due to uncertainty or unexpected events there is always a possibility there is always a possibility of in adequate profit or even losses okay so the uncertainty of profits puts business at risk puts business at risk listen carefully it means when anyone has established any business so the aim of that type of the person who has started the business it means the aim of the business is businessman is to earn profit to earn money but it is not sure that in future the businessman will earn profit it is not definite okay so there is the chances of loss also it means the businessman earn, earn the profit and also suffer or bear the loss so that type of the that type of the possibilities relates from the profit or loss so this is relates from your business risk clear students so i want to give one example also here so listen carefully example a business import goods and sells a business import goods and sells in the domestic market domestic market okay suddenly suddenly due to increase in the exchange now beta page uh, pto please turn over next page is your page number 2 this is your page number 2 so i have written here suddenly due to increase in the exchange rate 
एंड इंपोर्ट ड्यूटी इंपोर्ट ड्यूटी इज एज लाइक अ टैक्स it has been paid by the businessman at the time of the imported uh, at the time of the import or any type of the goods from any other countries when the businessman purchase the goods from any other country so on that uh, on that time the businessman pay the tax for importing so that is related from the import duty and import duty the cost of product increases okay so if businessman increase the price if business uh, business here uh, i want to tell about the business risk so we will use business if business increase the price if business increase the price it may loss it may loss lose okay this is the correct word lose its customers and if it keeps the price then it may not be able to cover its cost so in both situation business will lose profit yeah lose profit in both situation the business in both situations business will lose profit so uh, try to understand that example i have told to you here a business import goods and sells in domestic market it means any businessman has purchased the goods from outside the country and that type of the goods has been sold out in their own country suddenly due to increase in the exchange rate and import duty of the cost of product increases when the import duty or exchange rate will be increased so it will be also affect the cost price of the product if that import duty or exchange will increase exchange rate will be increased so the cost price of the product will also increase so at that situation the price of the product has been increased so if the goods if the cost price of the goods has been increased so the businessman increase the price of that product so there is the chances for lo uh, loss their customer it means loss means khona in hindi you can tell it khona it means the businessman lost their customers apne customer ko wo kho sakta hai and if it keeps the price it may not be able to cover its cost if that businessman maintain their previous price of that commodity of that goods so maybe that type of the cost that type of the cost price of the goods will not be covered so the, this is the that type of the situation is related from the loss of the business it means that is related from the at that time the businessman will not earn profit will not stable in the market okay so that type of the thing is related from the business risk clear students now nature of business risk it means what are, what is the nature of the business risk so nature of business risk here i want to explain about some nature relates from the business risk as like point number 1 business risk arises due to uncertainties you know about that uh, there is uh, nothing uh, no one is certain it means it is not sure what will be happen in future okay for example you know about the situation of the current scenario as like corona virus so no one has think about it in the past so same thing will be related from the business risk so we can also compare it this is related from the uncertainties as like think about that type of the businessman who has uh, performed their business activities who was uh, performed their business activities from last many years but now 
this is the situation there is they are in that uh, situation in your country there is totally lockdown in your country okay only some businessman has opened their uh, business shops or any other uh, material that will be related on the medicine fooding or etc but maximum business concerns are closed so that is related on the business risk also because due to that type of the lockdown due to that type of the corona virus each and every type of the business will also affect so it is the best example for the business risk okay so it is based on the uncertainties because each and nothing is certain okay your second point is risk is a risk is an essential part of every business it means without risk you cannot uh, earn profit you have also listened maybe maximum person has also listened about that type of the quotations more risk more gain it means that type of the business each and every type of the business is also related from the risk it means risk is an essential part of any type of the business third part is third nature is degree of risk degree of risk depends upon depends upon the nature and size of business it means the the degree the percentage or the uh, chances for profit or loss it will be dependent on the nature and size of the business okay beta next fourth point is profit is the reward of bearing of risk it means at last you know about that each and every one business each and every type of the businessman earn the profit so it is the reward of bearing of risk clear students so these are the nature of business risk now next topic is causes of business risk it means what are the reasons of business risk so students there are so many causes <coughs> here some uh, will be explained by me okay so listen first is natural causes natural causes okay listen carefully natural causes means that uh, type of the reason is related from the nature as like flood earthquake famine so that type of the causes is based on the nature so these types of the causes are called natural causes so as like we, uh, we want to explain it here natural causes like flood comma now page number 3 students flood uh, natural causes like flood earthquake famine etc lead to loss of life and property resulting into loss of business opportunities loss of business opportunities okay so this type of the reason is based on the natural causes okay uh, so uh, one thing more this type of risk is beyond human control it means without human control that type of the risk that type of the um, uh, causes has been happened but it can be minimized with insurance okay second top second reason is second causes is human causes 
ह्यूमन कॉजेज ह्यूमन कॉजेज ह्यूमन कॉजेज लाइक लाइक पावर फेल्योर स्ट्राइक्स और लॉकआउट्स मैनेजीरियल इनफिशियंसी लीड टू लॉस ऑफ लीड टू लॉस ऑफ प्रोडक्टिविटी ओके सो इट विल बी रिलेट फ्रॉम दैट द रिजल्ट इज द बिजनेस विल सफर द लॉस द बिजनेस विल बियर द रिस्क ओके इट्स effect is increases the uh, the cost increases the cost of product and decreases in business profits decreases in business profit or result into losses okay business profits or result into losses so this is also based on the cause of the risk okay students that is your second cause that was your second cause human causes next is economic causes third economic causes so listen and look economic causes like like fluctuation in demand due to change in prices comma taste preference preferences or market or market conditions increases the increase the possibility of a risk these are relates from the economic causes clear students now fourth and last causes is external causes external causes external causes means possibility of business risk increase business risk increases due to increases due to political instability political instability terrorism okay now next page in your next page this is your page number 4 of today's class i have also explained terrorism then mechanical failures fluctuations in exchange prices etc fluctuations in 
एक्सचेंज प्राइसेस एक्सेट्रा ओके दीज आर रिलेट फ्रॉम द एक्सटर्नल कॉजेज ऑफ बिजनेस रिस्क सो स्टूडेंट्स इट्स क्लियर नाउ How many types of the risk I have explained here? Causes of risk, natural causes, human causes, economic causes, and external causes. If you have any doubt, then you can ask the query in my personal WhatsApp number. Don't hesitate. So, students, this is your last topic of chapter number first. That is types of business risk. It means how can you classify the types of business risk here business risk has been classified into four types first is speculative risk <clears throat> mm, here type of risk which is रिजल्ट ऑफ मार्केट कंडीशंस इट हैज इक्वल पॉसिबिलिटी ऑफ गेन एंड लॉस इन सच टाइप ऑफ द रिस्क विल बी रिलेट ऑन दैट If the market condition is favorable, then the business will earn the profit. If the market risk uh, market condition is unfavorable, so the business will bear the loss. Okay. Second, pure risk. This type of risk, which in which business suffers loss only in the event of happening of risk it means if any type of the event will happen then the businessman will suffer the loss bear the loss otherwise no that type of the risk is based on the pure risk third is insurable risk this type of risk in which the probable loss can be insured on payment of on payment of premium to the insurance company insurance company it means that type of the risk can be covered that type of the uh, loss that can be covered with the help of the insurance company okay so that type of the risk is based on the insurable risk clear now last fourth risk is this is your page number 5 of today's class last fourth risk is uninsurable risk un insurable risk uninsurable risk this type of risk which cannot be insured as the probability of loss of loss cannot be determined it means that type of the risk 
कैन नॉट बी इंश्योरेबल इट मीन्स नो वन इंश्योरेंस कंपनी हैज प्रोवाइडेड द इंश्योरेंस फैसिलिटीज ऑन सच टाइप ऑफ द रिस्क ओके स्टूडेंट नाउ क्लियर सो स्टूडेंट्स टूडे आई एव फिनिस्ड यूर फर्स्ट चैप्टर इट इज टू शॉर्ट चैप्टर ओके इफ यू हैव एनी डाउट रिलेट फ्रॉम योर दिस चैप्टर रिलेट फ्रॉम योर फर्स्ट चैप्टर नेचर एंड पर्पज ऑफ बिजनेस देन यू कैन सेंड एनी क्वेरी इन माई पर्सनल व्हाट्सअप नंबर आई विल रिप्लाई इन द ग्रुप ओके स्टूडेंट्स नाउ इन नेक्स्ट क्लास आई विल स्टार्ट माई सेकेंड चैप्टर ओके स्टूडेंट्स After some time I will also share the homework okay